Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to do something a little bit different today. I wanted to do like a more chill and relaxed kind of nighttime skincare routine. I get a ton of questions about my skincare routine all the time, so I thought what more perfect time to do that than now. So I'm just going to show you guys my step-by-step -step of what I do every night. So I'm just removing my makeup. I'm starting off first with the Pharmacy Berry Cherry Clean Makeup Cleansing Balm. Um, this is a limited edition scent, but the Green Clean is the same exact one it's just a different scent so I use this to remove my makeup it removes everything I love the way that this feels on my skin it's amazing definitely recommend and you want to just take this on your dry skin and then rinse it off that is the correct way to use it and it seriously removes all of my makeup so once I rinse that off I'm going into my Ule Hendrickson Truth Juice Daily Cleanser. This is my favorite cleanser at the moment. I always double cleanse. I definitely recommend double cleansing if you don't, especially if you're wearing a lot of makeup. So this also just is another step to remove anything else left on my skin that the makeup balm didn't remove. So I don't do a mask every single night, but I do try to do one at least once a week. Today I was just taking the 4th Ray Beauty AHA Moment AHA Enzyme Mask, and I really like this one. Some other favorites of mine are the Glam Glow Super Mud Mask and the Ule Hendrickson Fat Glow Facial Mask. And I'm just applying this with a little like fan brush. This is from Dermalogica, but they don't have it on their website anymore. Um, but I'll try to find something similar on like Amazon or you can just apply it with your fingers. I'm just being a little extra. So once I rinse that off, I'm going into my Pixi Glow Tonic. This has been my holy grail toner for literally like three years now, I think. I've used it forever and I absolutely love it. Moving on to serum, I'm taking the Ulla Hendrickson Banana Bright Vitamin C Serum. Um, I just got this, so I just started using this. I don't really have an opinion on it yet. So far, so good. But the serum I've been using for the last couple months has been the Pharmacy Very Cherry Bright Serum, and it's really good. I just want to try something new, and I really like this new Ulla Hendrickson one so far. I use everything else from this line, so I was like, I might as well incorporate this into my skincare routine. And for moisturizer, also from Ulla Hendrickson, this is the Sea Rush Brightening Double Cream not the original one I use the original one during the day but for night I take the double cream because it is a little bit thicker and it's just a little bit more moisturizing again I love this entire line So for my eyes, I'm taking the Dermalogica Biolumin C Eye Serum. This is a newer product for me. For the last couple months, I've been switching between the Pharmacy Cheer Up Eye Cream and the 4th Ray Beauty The Daily Eye Cream. I like both of them. I just didn't really notice too much of a difference in my under eyes, so I wanted to start trying something new. I love the way that this Dermalogica one feels under my eyes, but I haven't used it long enough to really see a true difference, so I'll definitely keep you guys updated. So because my skin has been more dry lately, I have started using oils again. This is the 4th Ray Glow Up Oil. I love this oil. It just makes my skin look and feel so amazing. And I don't know why I stopped using oils in the first place. I was using them for a while and I just started again. But I love this oil. It is so good. It's definitely one of my favorites. So once my skin is nice and oiled up, I like to go in with a gua sha. I think that's how you say it. Um, this has a lot of good benefits. You guys can look it up, but it's like relieves tension, lymphatic drainage. It sculpts the face a little bit, but you have to go in with like with an oil on it because if not, it's kind of like tucking at your skin, but I love this. Then I'm taking the Co Bigelow My Favorite Night Balm. I've talked about this so many times, but it's my favorite lip balm in the entire world. I literally don't use anything else. It's the only thing that doesn't irritate my really sensitive lips. And then I'll just take some body lotion. I use anything, honestly. This one's just from eCooking. 
But that is it, you guys. That is my skincare routine. That is what I do every single night. I love skincare. It's my favorite thing to do at the end of the day. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you guys did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below of your favorite skincare product, and I'll see you guys next time.